Oh, using our board. Oh, that's the uh, tone control. Oh, that's a tone control, right? Eh? This is a power supply for that preamp. It's a... oh, how the VX Plus performs, uh, and Ralph Jeffrey is setting up the VX now, oh. controlling the on-off. Okay, okay. Uh, okay also the back one. The GPS on three four five. And the signal port. Something that we can uh, drink out the mustangs that uh, when you're crossing the street and taking the video, you're not violating Philippine law. Alright, guys, it's my time to uh, demo my uh, personal project. It's been cracking here, and uh, you know, um, using fiberglass, uh, there's some uh, issue on it. Uh, it's not really pretty cool. This is a class D amplifier with like uh, uh, 30 watt at 8 ohms. And uh, let me power it first, sir, in case. Hello, sir. Pangamayong usuk yan. Right, so this amplifier is called uh, the DR100 watt. And um, uh, technically speaking, it's in the standby mode right now. You see the uh, green LED over there, it's uh, um, lighted up. Uh, but um, the LCD is off, and you can see the power on it here. So when I hit the power on off uh, then uh, the LCD will go into light up uh, um, maybe you cannot see that one but uh, it says the power supply on and turn on the system power supply and goes into the active mode and uh, with the uh, volume control uh, going up uh, that is in minus dB so uh, the lower the number the uh, higher the volume so you can see the uh, uh, relays uh, and switch mode power supply is actually uh, turning on right now and let's see increase the volume and uh, what happened in here why there is no sound uh, the B the DVD player actually is not playing <laughs> how to play the DVD sir uh, there you go. okay and then turn it on now yeah it's really uh, primitive and uh, I'm not really sure <laughs> <laughs> and it's loading and um, while it is loading let's see again um, I say this is the uh, hybrid uh, tone controls with other hey guys uh, I apologize that I need to lower down the volume if not turn off the volume because um, the uh, music that we use is uh, copyrighted and um, it's not allowed to use a copyrighted otherwise I will get a copyright strike let me turn off the volume and uh, this is the hybrid tone control uh, comprising the analog and digital um, section and this is the class D uh, amplifier and this is sweet smooth power supply and that is the um, uh, AC control for controlling the 250 volts uh, AC so you can uh, put it into uh, standby mode and uh, you know deep sleep mode and uh, I cannot show you the uh, controller which is uh, just below the uh, tone control board it's over there this uh, LCD is uh, programmed to turn off after uh, five minutes so five minutes later the LCD will turn off to conserve power and that is the uh, power management uh, uh, implementation and actually this is a sample uh, to uh, St. Louis University turn off button then uh, you can actually put all the circuit into a deep sleep mode okay that's the DR100 watt concept which is an educational um, hardware and uh, software and um, we just use uh, audio amplifier because we love audio I'm pretty sure that you wanted to hear how the class D amplifier the DR100 watt concept project uh, sounds uh, performance uh, compared to the VHEX uh, or the tube amplifier. What I can do right now is that um, I direct you to my uh, YouTube channel, the DR100 Watt Concept Project here, or you can click uh, this uh, link above and it will take you to the DR100 Watt Concept channel. In here, I uh, discuss uh, most of the aspect of the project uh, in terms of hardware design, um, integration of module driving all the hardware with the software including uh, some reliability and the other thing you can do is that uh, you can follow me on my personal website 
one DIY shared comb and I have discussed here several amplifier the class AB DNY 40 watt or the P3A2 as well as another class AB which is the Nathan power amplifier and um, the uh, DR 100 watt concept project is also there slowly by slowly it's not yet totally complete but it's in there thank you for dropping by to my website uh, and to my YouTube channel Okay, this is a push pull uh, tube power amp with 25 watts per channel output using a PV vertical scanning tube, the 6LU8. The, this 6LU8 tube has a built in uh, triode and a pentode in one envelope. Okay, wait, wait, wait. They are, they are lighting up right now? Yes. Alright, it's uh, glowing slowly and it's, they call it a fire inside the bottle oh it's a fire inside the bottle yeah. this amplifier is uh, inspired by the Muller 520 amplifier circuit of old so we have we have a we have an input tube and a long tail pa pa phase splitters uh, in the circuit which and one is the input tube sir uh, this is the oh, input, small one. Yeah, the small one is the input tube. Mm, is it is it hot? Uh, yes, oh, it's yeah. hot. It's it can get now. as hot as two hundred degrees. Wow, that's uh, cooking the egg already. Yes. if you put it in there. <laughs> wow. wow, it's really nice. It's a very different one from uh, what we have with the VHEX and uh, the R one hundred water. Yes, it's tube technology. Yes, yeah, it's a tube technology, and um, actually there is a brand. Uh, it's called the uh, Tube Tech. Um, this is a tube tech 6 LU8. What is notice noticeable with this amp is the generous filtering used in the power supply. It oh, uses, this is a brown one, sir? Yes, it's brown one. It, it used uh, 1000 microfarad 450 volts capacitors. Mm -hmm. So that ripple is very low. You mean the ripple, uh, the power uh, ripple supply ripple voltage? voltage. Yes. Okay, great. Yeah, I also apologize that uh, I cannot show you the uh, live performance of the vacuum tube from uh, Master Tony, the tube tech. It's because, again, for the reason that uh, the music that we use is uh, copyrighted. If I do that, I will be penalized with a copyright strike, and that is not good. Yes, the bad thing is that uh, we're talking about amplifiers and we need a good music, our favorite music, uh, to uh, play it into the amplifier and listen to our favorite music. But uh, you know that our favorite music, most of it are copyrighted. The other thing again that I can um, ask you is um, first uh, you get a schedule from Master Tony and uh, you can visit him and his house and you get a live performance uh, of uh, his vacuum tube amplifier, the tube deck. Uh, of course, the other thing you can do is uh, again visit my channel, which is um, uh, the TR100 Watt concept where I compare the uh, vacuum tube and a class AB amplifier versus a class D amplifier where probably you can hear the difference between these uh, three classes of amplifier. And of course, the, the third thing you can do is that uh, you build your own class A, class AB, and class D amplifier, and you can compare them. And that is the best. Stop, stop. I feel the bass. It's only for the electronics for the amplifier component. Two and from LBC. LBC? Yes. It's okay. around the water you are going to handle it. Building the relationship with different companies and the factory. Okay, so it's a lot of money. Thank you. When you first told me that, I understand you. I don't know. 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 It's Ferdinand and you once again and thank you for watching our video the mini EV at Master Tony's place so, this message is from Master Tony there is no issue that we cannot resolve we have the technical know-how and uh, the means 
to tackle any problem that will come our way. Okay. If you like our video, please subscribe and thank you very much for supporting us. Bye for now and see you in the next video.